whether or not a mall would be profitable. Manufacturing companies use our census data to determine if it would be lucrative to build a new manufacturing plant in the area. So it's used in many different ways. But basically, for the 2020 census, once again, it is our job, our mission, to count everyone once and only once and in the right place. This is my fourth census, so don't try to calculate my age. I started when I was two. <laughs> but when I took the job in 1990, it was a job. Now, it's a mission. Because I understand the impact of what that census data can do for us. We are our brother's keepers, okay? It impacts the way that we live. Because of the astronomical growth in Greenville and Spartanburg and Charleston and Columbia, we need those federal dollars, you know? Let's, for a minute, think about the schools. Let's say that a, a school has budgeted for 8,000 students, or 80,000 students in Greenville's case, but 90,000 shows up. We got to educate. So we start cutting programs such as music, arts, sports. And is that fair to our children? Have you ever gone to an agency or know someone that's gone to an agency for some type of help? and was told, we would love to help you, but we don't have the money. The numbers, believe it or not, follow the numbers. 